I have finally found the solution that almost every cloth diaper parent has a question for. How do I get rid of poop stains from my cloth diapers? Finally figured it out. Now guys, I know this term genius gets thrown around a lot. I know Steve Jobs is a genius and Bill Gates is a genius. And who's that guy who solved poverty? Was it Mandela? Whatever. I humbly suggest that you guys should refer to me as a genius. So here's the recipe, how to get rid of your stains. This works on almost any cloth diaper and any baby products actually. Okay, so here it goes. Lemon, right? Or this is a lime. Lime, lemon, doesn't matter. Cut it up, make sure you get all the juice out, no seeds obviously. Put it in a bowl, obviously. Ginger, the fresher it is, the better it works. So make sure the skin is kind of light brown. If there's a scab over here, remove the scab, take the skin out and grind it up, take the juice from it. This is around 50 grams and put it in with half of a lemon. Now here, this is an avocado. Obviously everybody knows what an avocado is. Take the seed, we do not want the meat, okay? You keep that for whatever salad you wanna eat. Take the seed and crack it into half. It takes a lot of time, but it's worth it. There is a smaller seed inside, you need to grind that and put it out on the sun. It, let it uh, roast for another couple of days to get it like this really crispy thing. The second most important ingredient is the tears of men between the ages of 28 and 32. Now these are my own tears. I've been collecting it for the last six, seven years. If you have your spouse, a brother or a neighbor, if they won't cry easily, get them to watch the final episode of Breaking Bad, the time in the wire where a dies. Sorry, it's a spoiler for people. And Game of Thrones when the dies in the first season. I, I was watching it with a group of guys, everybody had tears. It's gonna work. The tears of men between the ages of 28 and 32, right here. And the last thing you'd need, and I think this is the most important, is there's, there's a plant called Swit. Swit, yeah, that's what I think it's called. It's S-W-Y-T, uh, this is the acronym for it, but it's gonna say, stop wasting your time. Stop wasting your time, guys. Please, this should be the last thing that you should worry about. Obviously, that was just, just a joke, okay? Please do not try that. I'd be very sad if I actually collected my tears. Maybe they are. Anyways, <laughs> stains on your cloth diapers are a good thing. Think about it. If your cloth diaper has stains on it, that means you have a happy, healthy child who is pooping. It's a cloth diaper. Your child is supposed to poop in it. And when poop happens, there are stains on it. The only person who's bothered by it is you. Make sure they're clean and that's it. If there are stains, so be it. They are just discolorations. Say if you went and climbed Mount Everest, the tallest mountain in the world. You would want some scars on your face to remember that journey, to have that inscription on your body that I did this. Think about those poop stains in the exact same way. Those are the battle scars, the war scars of your parenting days. And it should be celebrated, not something to worry about. This is a white t-shirt. Here, you see this? These are the lipstick marks of, of, it's my wife's lipstick marks. And you know, the only person it bothers? Me. That's it. If you are really worried about stains on your cloth diapers and you want to reduce the staining, put these stay dry liners on it. When your child poops, it reduces the staining. Our charcoal inserts don't show stains at all because they are a dark color. So we have designed products to kind of take away that worry, but even if something else is stained, please don't worry about it. You have far more important things to do. Take care of your family or enjoy the time that you have with your baby. You can spend half an hour removing that stain. You put that diaper on your baby again, it will be stained again. Put them out in the sun when it's a good day. The stains might lighten, but again, even that should do it just as a way of giving it some good energy from the sun and all of that. And if the stains get removed, so be it. And even if there are stains, who cares? It's a mantra. Say it. Who cares? Nobody does. Neither should you. And obviously, do not try the recipe that I gave you. I have no idea what I just said. I made it up. I looked into my kitchen. Whatever I had, I brought it out. Okay? Take care, guys. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you have any other questions for us, let us know. And bye.